Wednesday. Four games tonight. And it's Bucks and Heat as they'll tip it off. And Hot Shot will. He's got Slay Island on him. I'll give it up to Jay Money. Back to Lottie. Steps back from Plondo and knocks down the midi. It's looking at the shooting aspect. We're kind of like, oh, like what's going on? And you can see you're right off the rib. Looks like Majestic is just going to be guarding a rook So we'll see if that change does come about. What the Hot Shot gets the board. Over to Lottie going baseline. And Lottie's got four. Oof. Nevertheless, it provided some comic relief for us last week. And there's a three ball coming in from Rux here on his birthday. He's got six. Fifteen to ten. Well, he leads all scorers with eight. And knocked away. Slay Island up ahead to A. Rux. He'll pull the trigger. Plondo gets a free board and one. Plondo with already nine rebounds. Really liking what this guy uh, is bringing to the table. You know what I'm saying? Solidifying his place in the draft. We've got a lot. Of, I don't think they're fair weather fans either, man. I think a lot of these guys are in for the long haul. And a lot of people are all in on this Buck squad, which is looking real good. 21 points. Arux. Plondo. He's got 14. It's kind of hit or miss. Sometimes you get the aggressive Plondo where he's looking to get some Euro steps, some hop steps each time off the dribble to create his own looks, or he starts money. I don't know what it was at, completely at the start of the game, but uh, you gotta you gotta be able to change something up here, get it get it back to flowing. Of course, they ret retained Big Meat, retained A Rooks, and Big Meat will finish and one as they get the foul on drop. Should be a career game tonight for Plondo. He's on his way for sure. His hot shot now at 14. They just need to try to get some more. He's going to take another shot at it. No, sir. Plondo with another rebound. Rooks. This time he's able to hit the long two. <laughs> he's up. Missing the shots, you can say, you're not going to tell your player, hey, you're playing amazing defense. You're not. You're just smoking wide open. Now, if you're contesting a lot of these shots and making a miss, I don't know if Alex is around to hear my voice. But Josh Footy wants to know. I and yeah, it, it messed up my nose, and then I broke it a second time too. Ran, in, uh, ran into a pole, <laughs> so I don't, I don't have the best of luck. I mean, <laughs> nothing else my body's ever broken. It's just been my 18 rebounds. Have, have we had anybody hit 20 yet? We had a couple guys close to 20 rebounds. He's one away from that. I don't think we've had anybody hit the 20, 23. They get it into Plondo. Plondo, got to get a Chatty Nick. It won't count if it goes. That would have been the assist. That would have given him a triple double. They were yelling corner, corner, corner too each time. <laughs> Both these teams winless on the season, but we're just in week two. And nobody wants the tip. Again, I got Phil no respect. Did he go to the food truck again? No, he's up there. But there you go, guys. <laughs> a ping pong club is probably my favorite. It's almost spot on. As they knock down their first points of the game, J-Rod with a triple. The number one question asked in the chat for Alex is, when are you going to follow me back on social media? That seems to be the number one question, by the way. Final seconds here, the first. Vandy. Good look. That's his first bucket of the game. He ties things up at 15. Come on, J-Rod. So how about Vandy, which you can mix Toxic in there. He's kind of the veteran of the squad. Kind of counteracts the two 19-year-olds. And, and they're up by nine. They were creeping back into it, and Kev won't let him get too far away. And oh see what ha happened was control on the other end. Well, authentic African wasn't expecting to be to just a two-possession game, and then they turn it over. Up ahead of control. It's a two on one. Over to Vern. And Vern will throw it down. We got a four point game. 0 for 2 from the floor for the Toxies. And both of those shots were absolutely wide open. And Vert. Boy, Vert. Three point. Cal, that is a long three. Nothing but nylon. He's got 12. For them. 
Bandy, the rookie, gets it off the double A. For the two-hand jam, he's got 8.8 re here in the first two weeks. And there is Burt. And control block in the league there by Kev. They're up by four. Control with it. And he's got six points now. I told you it'd come down to the battle of the control. Like you gotta listen to me, you gotta trust me. And that's an even pretty short timeout. You gotta trust each other on the defensive end. Make sure you're picking up the right guys, not double teaming anybody by accident. But that's what you need right now. Here comes Vandy now. Takes a triple to tie. And here comes fourth quarter Vandy. You need. Yeah, you have the poor shooting and your teammates might give you a little bit of a hard time saying, hey, you made this game really stressful, but as long as... Ridge with a couple possessions left in this one. Got a score here. Vandy. This time they get the pass through in the jam. I'm not sure if I was moody there. Video games. Back up top to J-Rod. And he rattles it in. We got a two-point game. It's got to be a quick foul. Four-point win, 56-52. Lakers first regular season win. Weeks didn't make the trip over from Salt Lake City to New York, but it, he's feeling fine and he's out there. And that number around though, there's a man on a mission. He'll keep it alive. Compete over to Glennis. How about that for your first shot? Bang! They felt like they were gonna him and D right off the rip too, and. Uh... A big reason why he was drafted to this team was because of that. I feel like he could come in and maybe make a, a, a very good impact. There's no doubt about it. Rhea with the board. Up ahead to Mullen with a left hand. He's got five. It just seems like there's a different level of intensity from compete when he... He has played on a pure glass, and there's the takeover. Hard to get a rebound, and Moam's already got nine. He's four or five from the field. He's on a cold ring as well. What a dot to Sherman, sure. he can't hit. And Pee Pee Ball and cleans it up. That corner to corner pass is always such a risky <laughs> one because you're going right through the paint and people are getting ready to get the rebound. Shooter. Mo going to force it up and it rattles in. First bucket of the game for Mo. Find out tomorrow though. I think that's our second game of the evening as those two face off and there's no love lost. Get your popcorn ready. That's half of what they scored just a week ago against the Pacers. Williams just giving them buckets. He already earned He's playing at the four now. Uh, he was playing at the four, sorry, in the tip-off tournament. I think regular season where we saw him move down to the three. So now he gets more of an opportunity to try to score. Yeah, he was just waiting for Kaliz to come back. Take that. See, the thing I love about Rhea is they're so laid back. And they say, what was most he said? What the? He said, what, what is that? I can't say the one word, but it follows it up. So I don't know what this is. I'm praying that he's getting a dunk out of the hop step. But even the layup looked like it almost went through. Dimes. Well, knocked down at three, his first of the ball game. Seen him pass up several. Gliss. He's got nine points in his debut. Boy, compete. You think he's fine? Take it away. PP balling on the break. Mo lobs it up for Pete. Selfish play, a little showtime. But Pete has been very impressive as Gliz knocks down another three. He's got 12. Pete's been very impressive in the pick and roll defense. Lob for Pete. He's got 21 and 13. He may have a sharp rebounder on me. He has some badges and has the height, but it just seems like we're in a pure glass. It's a mix of uh, a pure rim, a rebound. We'll get it into Gliz. Ain't no time for this, I can tell you that. Pete will knock it down here at nine points, nine times. We'll give it a Mo, and they should be able to triple this out. He'll just force it up to waste the rest of the clock. And they're going to come away with a five-point victory in this one. 63 to 58 behind the double. Last night in their 51-47 win against the Cavs. Here we go. I called him 25 the other night. He had to reach out to me on Twitter. It's Jacko doing Jacko thing. We kind of hit on it with the Dave Fry and Mo for the Mavs. With the pick where you went for the change, and then you ended up getting Styles. Nobody has missed a shot yet. So you know what's going to happen next? <laughs>
The announcer's curse is real. Jacko throws it up. Okay, I'll take it back. A little 360 alley oop jam. <laughs> Easily could have been the player of the game last time out. He had 16 points, 18 rebounds in there. Eight point win over the Bucks. Their first win on the season. Because of the whole rainbow trade, but I mean, it's proven to just be a very, very close, tightly contested game here right off the rip. Matty ties his career high. Until that badge is completely gone, just because he'll be able to break him down so easily. It's one of the cleanest quarters of play we have. From a shooting perspective, Jacko at nine. I mean, they were combined twice. Matty seeing the final embers of that takeover burn out as Swizzard goes upstairs. He's got four. Team. But the Pacers were issued a warning as they got a little rowdy in that first quarter. So, Ramo, and he is up and talking. The community would fill up. We just called everything dribble, 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 dribble. Yeah, it would get real old real quick. Swizzard for three. Bang. Comes in averaging. Shot to this be blinking red on your stamina bar. You can't shoot jump shots. I mean, you can, obviously, but you're not going to green them. You'll just see a lot of full whites every single time. So you can kind of sag off. As he yells it out from the corner, you just have to trust him. You have to trust him that screen. Love and two love to kick things off. Yeah, things are getting interesting. Swizz. Take a three ball. Yes, sir. He's got 10. Off the mark there. Swizzer. Wolf able to finish. He's got seven. The Wolf Pack in full effect. You can tie the ball game right here with a three. And shows him the truth. Olay. Go into the rack. On the team, Phil, I would say yes, because this is a guy that hit back-to-back -back threes in a blink, <laughs> but he gives up a dunk right there. Oh, I thought that should have been a steal. Chasing it down, shot clock running down, and Lord Beezus. Wolf from the corner. Got it. To get something going other than just sitting there making it so obvious. Hey, guys, off ball. He's sitting there holding the screen for about 10 seconds. And Ramo will run out the clock. And you he can hear the wolf back. The chant of goodbye.